Woodfall has won the toss for the first time in this series of tests and has naturally decided to bat first. Chapman and his men are just taking the field. Larwood is opening the bowling to Woodfall. England have never won a test on this ground yet. And it doesn't look like they're going to win this one the way Bradman is batting. Every time he scores something, hardly a ball gone in this over that he hasn't scored from. Bradman has scored his century before lunch. The English team are just taking the field after the luncheon interval. Bradman's 199 now. That's his 200. Well done. Kipax is just out. He's made 77. And a wonderful stand with Bradman. The scoreboard reads remarkable at the end of the first day. 458 is the total, out of which Bradman has made 309 not out. It's a world's record. They're all surrounding him and patting him on the back. English team are just taking the field on the second day of the match. Looks like having another strenuous day in the field. Bradman's still at the top of his form. This young Don Bradman going out to continue his wonderful record of yesterday. He's accompanied by McCabe to the wicket. Larwood is opening the bowling to McCabe this morning. He just cut that one for two, I should think. Yes, a run two. Tate is bowling that end to Bradman. He's uh, just cut that one for two. Bradman seems as though he's going to score the fast. He's got another run out of it. Bradman seems as though he's going to score as fast this morning as he was yesterday. The Australian team is just going out to field. Thompson Sutcliffe are just going out to open England's batting. <laughs> Wall is opening the bowling to Jack Hobbs. He stepped aside for that one. Hobbs is always steadier in a crisis. Australia's total of 566 will make him play good cricket, I think, this morning. <laughs> well, Hobbs has turned that one. He doesn't like Grimmett, though. Run two for that. Now we've got Herbert Sutcliffe. 